la moy leal y noble ciudad. Iloilo is known to be as the heart of the Philippines, a heart-shaped island found right in the middle of the Philippine archipelago. Founded in 1566, when the Spaniards established a settlement area in the town of Buton and the district of Aribalo. The most loyal and noble city was given by Queen Regent of Spain, Maria Cristina, during the Philippine Revolution. Iloilo is best known for its Spanish colonial mansions and beautiful architectural churches. Let me take you to a ride to the place where I belong. Iloilo is rich in history, heritage, and culture. The one and only Queen City of the South. Iloilo flourished through the loyalty of the Ilongos and tagged as where the past is always present. The city of old and the new brings nostalgic memories for the Ilongos. Iloilo, the city of mansions. The Spanish rule lasted for more than 300 years in the Philippines. It comes as no surprise that Iloilo was the home of the country's elite families. Experience Iloilo, the world class in a young festival, the scenic beaches of Parao Rigata, and let me take you to Haro Fiesta, which is celebrated every 2nd of February of the year. Take a deep breath of clean air in Iloilo River Espanad and the Blue Lagoon of Isla Gigantes in Carlos Iloilo. I am Iloilo, proud to be Ilongo. Iloilo won the most bike-friendly city in a national competition in 2016. Now being tagged as the bike capital city of the Philippines, Iloilo. Dali na, malagaw kita sa Little Baguio of the Philippines, Bukari, Leon, Iloilo. Currently, Iloilo won the ASEAN Clean Tourist City Award and the Clean Air City Award way back 2017. Ang dakbanwa sang Iloilo in Hiligaynon is a first-class, highly urbanized city on Panay Island, situated in Region 6, Western Visayas. Iloilo City is a conglomeration of former towns which are now the geopolitical district consisting of Villa Aribalo, Iloilo City proper, Haro, La Paz, Mandoriao, and Molo. Hiligaynon is the dominant language of Iloilo City. English is used as the language of education and businesses. Caraya is widely spoken in the provinces of Iloilo. Spanish once widely spoken during the colonial era up to the 1980s and spoken by a few of the some Spanish blood families and the elderly sugar barons. Our history. Even before the Spanish colonizers came, Iloilo had a flourishing economy. We are rich in natural resources and minerals. Then Bornean Datos came to the islands of Panay and gave a gold hat, a salakot, and a long golden necklace as a peace offering and to the Ati natives of the island. It was said that it was also the way of the ten Borneo Datos to barter the flat lands of Panay from the Ati. One Dato named Paiburong was given the territory of Irung Irong. That's why it was called Iloilo. Iloilo was early colonized by the Spanish in 1566. The Ilongos and the Filipino martyrs fought a revolution way back in 1896. Then followed by the American colonial era and the Japanese occupation way back 1942 to 1945. The province brings natures at its best, such as the Mimais Inod Resort in Saraga, the Midway Organic Resto in Pasi, and the exclusively beautiful Park Regency and Padilla. Take a mountain trek on the way to Bato Galingaling in Anilao and experience the town hall of Mina. Feels like you're at the top of the world when you are at the Mount Lingahob in Tubungan and the charming seaside of Birdland Resort in Tigbawan. Dive into Rodson's Place in Sara and visit the oldest golf course in Asia in Santa Barbara. 
Feel the vast and muffled Obolobantak Falls in San Rafael and experience peace and calmness in Gajukate Jungle Huts in San Miguel. They call it Heaven on Earth, the Garin Farm Pilgrimage in San Joaquin, and take into the unspoiled Cabasan Cold Spring in San Enrique. Adorn the Paradise Island of Sua Beach in San Dionisio, and take a picturesque view of Maples Farm in Pototan. I've experienced Adhara Eco Boutique in Uton and the Mila Seal in New Lucena, and it's homey and cozy. The Miyagao Church was declared as a UNESCO World Heritage Site. And I've been to Tigum River of Maasin with my families and friends. Bukarilion is the little Baguio of the Philippines, and you will be fascinated with the Espia Inn at Resort in Limerick. Capture the moment at Sea Garden Ligonis facing the beautiful islands of Gemaras in the Tinagong Dagat of Lambunao. Bring your BFF with you and the Muris Hills in Aniwai and the unspoiled mountain ranges of Igbaras. Magbiay kita sa the iconic public plaza of Ginbal and the seafood capital of Iloilo, the Paon Beach Estancia. For sure, the kids will enjoy the Elmar Spring Garden in Dumangas and the Kalingawan Picnic Area in Duenas. The Moroboro Dam in Dingle is the best resource of water for the Ilongos, and the Kabugay Gamay in Carles is the best island paradise in Iloilo. The Alasent Ngurog Falls of Kalinog and the Giant Leaf of Kabatuan is one of the best places to be. Be diversified and carry firm in Dingawan and take a pic in the Alapasco Lake of Batad. You will bloom when you touch the sunflower farm of Baratak Nuevo, and I always love to go back to Nagpana Falls in Baratak Piero. Let me take you to Managopayo Falls of Banate and nature's as best in Opao Salong, Balasan. The Efrata farm of Bajangan is full of life and spirit. Feels like you're in heaven when you reach Matudungok of Almujan and experience the white sand beaches of Marbrena Ahoy. Ilongos are known to be malambing or soft-spoken. What makes Ilulo best is the Ilongo themselves, Graciano Lopez Haina, General Martin Chofelo Delgado, and Magdalena Gonzaga Halandoni. The bravery and compassion of Teresa Magbanoa Ferrares and the first three Filipina graduate nurses of the Philippines. Miriam Defensor Santiago is a pure Ilonga, the best president we never had. Fernando Jofilena Lopez Sr., one of the vice presidents of the Republic of the Philippines. Jose Marie Lim Chan, a singer, composer. Pura Villanueva Calao, the first Miss Philippines. Angela Gabrina Ong, Miss Earth 2015, and the newly crowned Miss Universe Philippines, Rabia Oxenia Mateo. Savor the native Ilongo food like Balenciana de Ilongo. You must try the Ilongo dishes and the delectable cuisines and pastries. The best La Paz Bachoy, the Pancit Molo, and the best Xopao in town. As the culinary capital of the Sud region, Iloilo is the home of the best restaurant and delicacies. And for sure you will love bizcocho and barquillos. Hablon and Uzi textile is a piece of an authentic Ilongo. A soft fabric local materials made in pinya, fiber, and Uzi. you never been to Iloilo if you never take a ride on the Pasa Jeepney. Yes, it's more fun in the Philippines and feel the beat of the drum in joining us in the Didek Yang Festival. Hala Bira Iloilo! Ilongos were known to be religious and faithful, and they always believed that faith does make things easy. It makes them possible. Iloilo's capital bagged the ASEAN Clean Tourist City Award. The Ilongos honors its cities, that are clean and green, and push for more sustainable tourism efforts. Education is our ticket to success. 
Ili Ili ranks the best universities and colleges in the Philippines and produces the cream of the top professionals and great leaders. Our loyalty in the loving nature of the Ilongos compasses us to be called as the city of love. Through our faith and the love of our family leads us to be a noble and humble Ilongos. The city is the regional hub of education, culinary, religion, healthcare, tourism, culture, fashion, industry, and economy. The Iloilo City government continues its effort and sustainability through buildings of parks and open spaces, the recreations, and improve the smart initiative of information and technology, focusing more on healthcare transportation, the airport, seaport, a cycling railway, the power and energy, the water supplies, and education. And making the metropolis a clean and conducive to tourists and the Ilongo themselves. Iloilo International Airport ranked as the number 12 of the best airport in Asia. Iloilo Convention Center hosted local and international summits, conventions, seminars, conferences related to politics, socio-economic, cultural, and religious events. Karika sa Iloilo, ang lugar sa mga mapinalangkaon kag matahom nga Ilonggo. Right at the heart of the Philippine Islands, mabuhay ka Iloilo. Saktagon natin ini. Where the past meets its present. This is Kriyajit Vlogs and greetings from the city of love, Iloilo. God bless everyone.